Hi guys, today I decided to show you these three simple fall makeup look that you could do every day or not every day, it's up to you guys. I don't always wear makeup on a daily basis, so these are a little bit extra for me as an everyday makeup look. But to some, it may be a perfect look for every day, so I kind of put together a little something that is simple, easy to recreate, and fall appropriate. And let's get to it! Okay, so as you guys can see, I already did my foundation, setting my eyelids. Oh, wait, I haven't. Okay, so I already did my face. Um, pretty much all of my face is done. So I'm just going to show you guys how to do the first eye look. Okay, so first thing that I'm going to do is uh, I'm going to prime my eyelids with the trusted Maybelline Adrian Wine Concealer. For the first look, I'm going to use this oldie but a goodie Morphe palette, which is the 35O. The first shade that I'm going to use is, is this shade right here. You can use any crease brush that you have. I'm going to put this as my transition shade, but, but I'm going to bring it um, closer to my lid. Usually you put your transition shade on your crease, right? But I am going to put it on my lid. So I haven't set my eyelids yet. <laughs> I'm a mess. I'm going to set my eyelids first with this color right here. So now we're done and we can get back to the transition shade. So I'm going to put this color closer to my lid. And now after you're done um, packing those colors and constantly blending them onto your lid, next thing that you have to do is, let me pick what shade I'm going to use. Please, I'm going to take this shade right here. And I'm going to put this color using the same brush. I'm going to put this color closer to my lid. Like really, really closer to my lid. Just now, I'm blending those color closer to my lid. But I'm kind of bringing it upwards. But I'm going to blend this super closer to my lid. And slightly downward than the last shade. onto your lid like this and just we have to make it look messy because we are going for this messy smoky eye kind of look so you have to put the color directly on your lid like this and just kind of blending it gradually at the same time <laughs> done with that you're now going to take a like a fluffy blending brush this is Mac this is Mac 224 the shade right here blend them all out so let's move on to the lower lash line you just have to take those previous three colors so I'm going to take that shade again and just put it onto my lower lash line. And that is pretty much it guys. And if you want to pull out some wing liners, you can do it. I kind of want to do a natural... natural. <laughs> I kind of want to do a natural look today. So I'm, I'm just gonna put on some mascara or um, lashes so I'll be right back. Um, I already put on some lashes and mascara so now we are going to jump into the lips. This one is from Colourpop and this is in the shade Mama. <laughs> Red, 
warm terracotta brown. I really, you do not know how much I love this. Okay, so the next shade that I think it is super cool for this look, also from ColourPop, it is the Ultra Matte Lit in the shade Love Bug. And as for the second look, I'm going to do a dark purple, grayish tone, cool tone, brown kind of look. So I'm gonna start off as usual by priming my lids using the Maybelline H Rewind Concealer. So as for the second eye look, I'm going to use this Tartus Pro Palette. So I'm going to start off by setting my eye primer as usual. I'm going to use this color called Vintage. So I'm going to put it all over my lid. Actually, I'm going to do the same thing that I did for the previous look, but I'm just going to change up the colors according to the tones that I set on every each look. I'm gonna do the same thing, so I'm going to take a smaller crease blending brush like this. I'm gonna take this shade called Cheek right here and I'm going to put it as my transition shade. So after I'm done packing and blending the color chic onto my eyelid, the next color that I'm going to take is this color right here called Profesh. Such a cool name. We're going to take another dark color, but this is going to be a little bit different because this color is quite dark so we have to pack it all first and then like smudge the color all away so i'm going to take this color drama this color right here and i'm just going to use my finger and pack this color right onto my lid done packing the color drama onto your lid you have to take the color the, the transition shade again which is called sheet and just blend them all together so after we're done with all those colors it's time for the lower lash line I'm going to take those three colors again and putting it onto my lower lash line and I'm starting with the darkest color drama so I'm some lashes and mascara I also changed my blush from the previous look I'm wearing something super kind of brown blush so, so as for this look I'm putting some pink blushes with purple highlight so it goes on with the look and we are going to proceed with the lips and it's from the Kylie cosmetics in the shade moon final look we are going for a cranberry sort of dark pink kind of look we are going to use this palette right here which is called take me back to Brazil palette by BH cosmetics this is getting a little bit repetitive but I'm going to set my eyelids first as usual so I'm going to use this orange color right here as my transition shade I know it's repetitive, but I'm going to do the same thing, putting it onto my lid, blend it from there. The next shade 
shade that I'm gonna take is is that pink right there and I'm going to put this all over the lid and kind of blend with the previous shade okay and the next shade that I'm gonna use right here it's sort of like the perfect cranberry shade and I'm going to put this all over my lid Like with this shade it completes the whole fall look because now it's just pretty much pink so I'm just gonna take this red color right here and put it all over my lid and the next thing that I'm gonna do is I'm gonna clean up the whole thing I'm going to take this shade right here to move on to the lower lash line I think this look deserves dramatic lashes so I'm gonna put on some and I'll be right back so mascara is on lashes are on and now we are going to proceed with the lip color this is from Colourpop and this is their ultra matte lip in the shade tool Tool. Tool. Like it is the perfect, perfect cranberry, perfect dark purple. I can't stress enough. So this is the finished look. Um, thank you guys for watching. And if you have any requests, just comment down below. Give it a thumbs up if you like this kind of video. And see you guys on my next one. Bye.